I could have finished all that okay, I said before, then I could try and explain. Blue flag is a symbol of excellent management. Excellent management on four areas. Water quality, environmental management, safety and services, and education. Okay? You, there's criteria in each one of these four areas. If you can fill these criteria, then you will be awarded a symbol. You will be accredited with a symbol that tells the public, be it the public in this municipality or tourists that come to this uh, to this uh, site, that this uh, this uh, beach or marina or boat, it doesn't matter, according to the different whatever it, the site is, is run in an excellent environmental way in a holistic way so it's not only about the environment it's about everything it's about accessibility for disabled people it is about um it is about the safety and uh, and, and and we check things like your uh, first aid kit when we do a when we do a visit we make sure that the defibrillator has the batteries uh, on there if all these things are checked because that's the safety. Yeah, please say in more for the Well, the person that will be responsible for uh, the will be the beach manager. But, but, it, right, right, right. In, in, different, in different countries it works differently. In some countries it's the Ministry of Health that sends somebody every week to the beach to take the water sample. All right, so, it's a, so I'm saying it's, it doesn't change the fact, it doesn't change the fact that if you want to have a blue flag, you need to take an X amount of samples during a bathing peak. Yes, there's a protocol. And that sample has to be sent to an accredited laboratory for the results. That's yeah, a simple look. Who does it? Who does it changes from one country to another? Sorry? What experience they have here in America? In Latin America we have, okay, so Brazil has, uh, has uh, Bandera Azul. Um, in, well, they've started, they started in the south and now it's, uh, it's moving, yes. So they have now about, I think, 30 or 40 Bandera Azul in Brazil. Colombia is now starting, so the, it was started by the Ministry of uh, the Ministry of uh, Tourism in Colombia that wanted their beaches to be. So now we found the NGO. They helped us to find the NGO to take over, and they become the member, and they will run the program. The program in uh, Colombia. We have it in, um, and then we have it in um, the Caribbean and Puerto Rico. And we have it in uh, Dominican Republic, and also in some other. Uh, we have it in the uh, U.S. Virgin Islands, and we have it in Saint Martin, etc. They've been devastated now by hurricanes. So another very important thing: Bandera Azul is given for one year. On the flag, there is the year of the of the award. So every year you need to apply again and again and again. You can't come and say, "Oh, we we are okay," because five years ago our water was good. Every year you you apply again and again. You have to show that the water quality tests were, were good. And I'll just give you an example why I'm saying that it's an excellent symbol. When we look at the water quality, it's built on the um, um, United Nations Health Organization and on uh, the EU's water directive. Okay, so that's how the cr criteria has, has been decided. The EU, the, Euro the European Water Bathing Water Directive. La de la de la ONU. Okay, you need to. F so they have what they what they decide is an excellent standard. So it's, uh, it's below certain amount of bacteria. 
the bacteria? How? how what's the I think it's two hundred. Uh, it's two hundred. Uh, so. Entonces, si la ONU dice esto, la, la, la eh, europeo, o sea, estamos hablando de excelencia. Entonces, so you need to be 95% of your samples have to be under that, 95%, which means that it's a bit, you, it, the, the margin of error is very small. Um, and in fact, we have a lot of very developed countries like Scotland or New Zealand, for example. You think New Zealand is so environmental. It's very hard for them to get the Bandera Azul because they have a lot of agriculture and a lot of rain during the bathing season and that affects, the, the, especially the sheep, it affects the quality of the water. So, you know, and that's it. I'm, so, I, I'm sorry for New Zealand and I'm sorry for Scotland. They can't have the Bandera Azul and because it doesn't work. They monitor them, so. every month, every week? Well, they have, to, they have to have at least water sample within, within the month. With, within 30 days, every a water sample. And they send it to you. To they, they don't have. They don't have to send it to us all, all year round. They send. What they do is, you take the sample. You have to inform the public about the result of the sample. We usually do it in a very, in a very uh, simple way. So we say, a sad face means that the water is very bad. Um, a not so sad face means that the water is so so, and a good a smiley means that you're above uh, you're above the level required. So, you, because the public doesn't understand what the uh, uh, you know what, what bacteria. So yes. Y en el caso de que la ¿Ellos se ¿Ellos se Sí, la sí. Ellos sí. Principalmente ¿Qué es lo que va a la que propende esto. Y en realidad, al, cuando uno decide tener una playa bandera azul, es porque aprendes una forma de trabajar de manera sustentable y responsable sí. con el medio ambiente y un turismo de excelencia. Por lo tanto, es el mismo concesionario o municipio o administrador de la playa el que va regulando cada uno de los criterios. Y tiene que trabajar en conjunto. Y tiene que trabajar, claro, trabaja en conjunto. Porque lo que uno no quiere es perder la bandera azul, la bandera azul que se fiscaliza una vez al año. Igual que una, cualquier certificadora. Ahora, la cantidad del agua, eso es mensual. Y acá, por ejemplo, también hace poco se hizo un nexo estuvo con la universidad, porque acá por ejemplo la universidad Calle Ancha tiene un laboratorio de medición de calidad de agua ¿está el laboratorio? entonces la idea es que el mismo concesionario va y muestrea la armada en este caso también monitorea las playas cuando les dice si está apta o no está apta no, eso es salud, salud. Es sal, sal, no, pero la, eh, la armada transfiere al servicio de salud y en base no, a eso no, el salud emite la So ellos emiten el informe, okay, pero, si, pero, pero si, la, si la servicio de salud dice que la calidad del agua no es la óptima, la Armada puede decir que ahí se puede bañar. No, dice que esta ya no ha. No, 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 no Por eso te digo, ese es claro. el este, es conducto. Pero el que hace es tomar muestra de salud. El servicio de salud, pero ese es el mecanismo. Pero si trabaja en conjunto con el gobierno, con lo nacional, con respecto a también a la concesión. No puede ser que tú mires el agua y no puedes que diga así, ahora está buena. Y la bandera es un organismo que es el que valida eso. Sí, ¿Ustedes como organizan ellos? ¿Ustedes para, 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 para mantener la acreditación? I will try and explain if I understand. First of all, you can't be half pregnant. No puede estar mitad embarazada. You're either excellent or you're not excellent. ¿Estás embarazada o no lo estás? So if, if you want to have the blue flag, you have to fit all the criteria. Sí, okay. sí, We don't have bronze, silver, gold, no, no blue hay, flags. Está no. sí, muy claro. ¿Quién controla ese embarazo? Well, ¿Quién, es que es then, ¿Quién me dice a mí que está embarazada? Then there are the way you get the award. Okay? The site, so it would be the municipality, for example, makes an application to the national operator. So this is the national operator of Bandera Azul in Chile. 
Okay. They, they make an application, and, they, and in the application, there's a whole bunch of data that they need to show. They need to show the water samples of the previous year. They need to do this, and there's, and there's a whole thing there. Pictures, you know. The whole, they give it to the national operator. The national operator goes over it and says, "Okay, this is a good application. I'm going to pass it to the national jury. The national yes, jury." The national jury has representatives of the Almada, of uh, the Ministry of Environment, from uh, maybe the life-saving, uh, if you have a union of the life-savers, you know, uh, etc. So this uh, the Ministry of Health, Ministry of Education, um, re represent representative, the representative of the National Council of Municipalities. Okay? All, they sit on the national jury they meet once per year usually and they go over all the applications and they ask questions and they argue and they they say okay they're absolutely blue flag these not so much these absolutely not and then they pass their decision their recommendation to an international jury that meets in Copenhagen once a year and that is the final decision about who gets the blue flag now, if, if the national operator and the national jury says to us, this is a good beach, usually there's no problem, they automatically will get it. The only time that the, the international jury debates is if there's question marks. So if, for example, if last year you had bad water uh, samples, they look into it, or if we found out that there was misconduct, etc., then we will be much, then the international jury will be very careful. On the international jury are representatives of UNESCO, of UNEP, of the World Tourism Organization, of ILS, the International Life Saving uh, so uh, Society, um, ICOMIA, which is the International um, uh, Union of Marinas in the World. All the, they're, they're, they send their, and they decide. Now, now this beach the international uh, jury says okay this beach can get the blue flag you get the blue flag it goes up during this year during the season that the blue flag is up the first responsibility to control the blue flag criteria is by the management of the site okay they need they need to make sure that everything is okay they need to make sure that uh, the beach is clean they need to make sure that the toilets are operating and clean That's your responsibility okay? 